everyone. Welcome to today's live stream. My name's Liz. I have a DIY YouTube channel called Liz from McDIY. And today I'm sharing with you all of my favorite finds for spring, spring home decor. This is probably my favorite topic and category to do here on Amazon because I have a lot of home decor that I buy off of Amazon. I'm here with my content manager, Delaney. She is behind the scenes. So if you have any questions, comments, go ahead and leave them in the chat. Delaney will make sure that I see them. Uh, Delaney and I are based out of Kansas City, Missouri. It is raining here, raining all week. Not the best weather, but we're here. We got our lighting ready. Um, I'd love to know where you guys are joining us from. So go ahead and leave that in the chat for, my, for us. Uh, Trinette is joining us again on Amazon and I see Christy here. So hello guys, happy to see you. Anybody joining us yet on YouTube? Yeah, popping those up on the screen now. We have Cynthia joining us from Florida. Hey, Cynthia. Jeanette from Paris, Texas. Hi Jeanette. Tammy from California. Looks like it's raining there as well. Yeah. It's raining yeah. everywhere. Hi Tammy. And we got Krista from North Carolina. Hey Krista. And Diana from California. Hello, and Alana. It looked like, let me know your guys' names. Uh, Miss Carla, but tell us what your name is. A lot of people join in New Jersey, Texas. So glad you guys are here. Let us know your names and we'll give you a shout out. And if you're not following us here on Amazon, make sure you do that because we go live a couple times a week sharing our best deals. And if you're watching on YouTube, I want to show you how to get over here. There's a link over on one of here, one pick the arrow, and then there's going to be a link in the description box. You want to click on that. It's going to take you directly to where I'm live streaming. Um, and all the products are going to be there. You can shop and add them to your cart. Hi, Shannon and Carla. Thanks for letting me know your name. Sorry. I'm just, sometimes I just start reading stuff on here. That makes sense um yeah so glad you guys are here i have a ton of products to share with you so let's jump in first and foremost i have this gorgeous bowl now there's a brand here on amazon called creative co-op and they have some really cool decor so if you're ever looking for decor i do recommend going to their page um, because i i love a lot of their stuff so this bowl for me is a great um side table bowl it's also great as a centerpiece you could put this on your table with some fruit in there i also think it's one of those great wood bowls that you could put your keys in um you know really you could do like the faux balls you could do faux plants in here as well but it's just so pretty it's got this nice detail along the edge sorry a pedestal now the pedestal is glued to this it's not completely connected and then it's got a nice felt bottom but i love the color of it i feel like it's a pretty good size so a great bowl and this is priced at 32.99 and it's got great reviews here on amazon hi bobby thanks for joining us kaylin thanks for the follow um if you guys follow us we'd love to give you a shout out so go ahead and hit that follow button now earlier this year i kind of did a mini revamp on my closet and one of my favorite things that i added to my closet are these motion sensor lights these are so cool, you guys. They come in a pack of three, and you just put three AA batteries in there. They also have some command strips. So I put them at the top of my closet. So anytime I walk into my closet, they automatically come on. Like these are so cool, so awesome. I love that I don't have to switch on the lights. Think about any area you have that's dim light that you just want to have it motion centered. You can easily do this. You don't have to do any wiring at all. Just change out the batteries. And, you know, we've had these. Gosh, I think we did that video in November, Delaney. Wasn't that November? Yeah, we've had these several months now. I have not had to change out the batteries. They both still work perfectly. Oh. So a really good option, you know, in your closet, or maybe you have like a tiny hall closet, these would be great for as well. And this is a set of three. So I think Liz still has one of them. Let mm -hmm. us know if you have any ideas of what we should do with that last one. We thought about maybe putting it by her dog's food. We thought that would be kind of funny, but yeah. if you guys have any good <laughs> ideas other than a closet for these, let us know. We love hearing your guys' ideas. Uh, Loretta, thanks for joining us today. And Jeanette, thanks for the follow. 
All right, you guys. Now, another item I've really been getting into lately are these essential oil diffusers. Now, if you don't have one of these, I feel like they're so affordable, honestly, more affordable than candles. And you can change out the scent depending on your mood or what you have going on. So this one on Amazon is $25.99. I feel like it's really pretty. It honestly just looks like a vase in my home decor. And let's be honest, some of the diffusers aren't that cute and they look like diffusers this to me looks great i don't mind having it sit out you just combine water with a few drops of your favorite essential oil and it just you know fills up the entire room i have it on my lower level where i have like my living room and my kitchen and this in no time will just fills up the space it also has a light if you'd like to turn that on so you can customize the light color as well it also has an option where you can set it for maybe a half hour or an hour so you don't have to you know remember to turn it off and it just plugs into the outlets but yeah, love this diffuser. Now to go along with this diffuser, these essential oils that I have, there's six of them in there. And for me, I don't need a lot of scents. So I feel like they kind of work well for me. Uh, you know, I feel like I have plenty with these and these are all um, the organic USDA organic ones. And you get six cents for $11.99. So those two items combined, I think are a great deal. Now, all the products are gonna be linked beside me if you're on your mobile phone. And every time we talk about a new product, it will, um, ha it'll open up and you guys can click on them and add them to your cart. Hey, Nicole, thanks for coming back and watching today. Hope you're able to find some good finds. Now, if you're not into essential oils and you prefer candles, my favorite brand of candle here on Amazon is the brand Lulu. They are practically one of the only brands I found on Amazon that had really good soy candles. Now, my favorite one that I have is the scent is Jasmine Oud and Sandalwood. It smells so good. Like the first time I took this out of the box, oh my gosh, like it was just overwhelming. The scent was not overwhelming, like in a, in a good way. Like it just had a good scent payoff. I get so frustrated when I buy candles and they just don't have a good scent. So it smells nice when it's not lit. It also smells great when it's lit. The other cool thing about this candle is it looks nice. You know, I don't mind having it sit out my decor because it's got this like kind of cool label on the front. And if you didn't want any label, you could always turn it to the back and it's just a black candle. So it looks really great sitting out in your decor. I love this candle. This is one of my favorite items we're showing you guys today. I actually picked one up for myself after we filmed this clip that you guys are looking at because I was so impressed by the scent payoff. Like Liz was saying, if you guys pick up one of these candles, as soon as you open that box, it just smells so good. Now, oh, I wanted to shout out LS Bowers. Thank you for following us. You guys go ahead and hit that follow button. Now, since we are talking items for spring, to me, this is like such a great spring item. So this is actually a set of coasters. How adorable are these little coasters? I have a clip showing them to you so you can see them up close and how adorable they are. But this is a set of four coasters you can get for $21.99 and they look perfect sitting out. Like for me, I like coasters that are honestly part of my decor and these are so pretty that they make a great, you know, you know, addition to your decor. So if you love a nice coaster, these are great. They'd also be great to sit out for the summertime because they have this beautiful rattan finish, but I just think they're perfect for spring into summer. Now, one of my bowls, these, you know, these are great for spring, but honestly, these are so versatile. And when I first picked up these bowls, I, you know, I have to be honest with you guys. I was not, you know, thinking they were going to be all that great. I wasn't sure what they were going to look like. And I was so impressed with these bowls because they are a set of scallop bowls with, if you know anything about, you know, decor right now, scallop is very much in. This is a set of three piece bowls and they're very thick. So I feel like these would be great bowls. To me, these are a set of bowls that you could use over and over again in so many different, um, you know, scenarios. You could put them out in your kitchen, maybe put two of them. You could put bananas in one, apples in another. They also would be great as wall art. Think about that, you guys. You could hang these on your wall. They would be so pretty. Um, you could also just use the larger one as a centerpiece. You could put, you know, maybe for Easter, you could put in 
some florals and some Easter eggs inside of here. You could also put this on your coffee table as well. I mean, they're really, you could use the small one to house keys. The options are endless with these. Look how well they stack up together. These also would make a great gift. If you know anybody who loves baskets or home decor, I just think you cannot go wrong with these. The quality on them is awesome. One of these, these are probably one of my favorite items that I've bought in the home decor space here on Amazon. All right, Lisa, thanks for following us here. Next up, now this is a fun little knot that you could put out as part of your decor. A lot of times people will message me and they want help with decorating their spaces and they'll be like, you know, I have all these plants, like how do I change it up a bit? One of the things I always recommend is getting a figurine or an item that's a little out of the box. And I think that really helps to break up your groupings when you have them sitting out on your fireplace or just your side tables. It just kind of looks really great in a grouping and it's that unexpected object. Now this one comes in a natural wood, but I believe it has other finishes as well, Delaney. Does yes, it, it does. If you guys click on that link, you're going to see you can also get a black option. They also have like a dark gray as well as kind of a whiter wood on that. Yeah, but this is a great item to have out, just kind of sitting out in your decor. And one of my favorites, I love the natural wood, but you, if, if you like another item, you could definitely get that. I've also had people ask me if you can paint these. You could totally paint them or stain them you know, depending on what your preference is. Okay, next up, you guys, is let's talk about some wall art. So this next set of wall art, I had this really long cabinet and I needed to fill up some space. And I think one of the best ways to do that is get a grouping of wall art. So I bought this three piece set of wall art. I went with the green tones because in this room, they're very green, but you can see how beautiful these three pieces of art look together. Delaney, can you tell me the size of one of those um, posters? Or I guess they're not posters. So it's 16 by 24 by three is the one that you picked up. Thank you. So the canvases are 16 by 24, each one of them. They look awesome in a set. So you could see here, I just put them onto this cabinet you could also you know hang them on a wall together but if you click on that link don't they come in so many different styles yes these come in a ton of different styles it looks like looks like there's about 20 to 30 different options of art that you guys can pick up they have more landscape options if you're looking for some more landscape options they also have more abstract colors as well we got this 16 by 24, which is what we're showing you guys in this, but you can also pick up 24 by 36 if that was something you were wanting. If you want it a little bit larger, even than the one we're showing you, you can get that. It also looks like you could get white frames or black frames as well as these natural frames that we're showing you. Oh, I didn't know that. I really like the color of the natural, but if depending on your look, the white or black could look really nice as well. It's just a very subtle frame and I just love the way it looks. Mm -hmm. This one for sure has a ton of different ways you can customize it to fit your style and fit your home. Mm -hmm. Now, if you're looking for florals, you guys, I feel like florals can be one of the hardest things to find and get really realistic ones. This set is probably one of my favorites. So all of these branches that are in this kind of terracotta vase come in this set. So you get a set of five branches and I put them into this vase. And these to me look so realistic. They are so pretty. I feel like they just fill up the space on this side table. They're one of my favorite items. So if you're needing some florals, these might be great. If you have a vase you need to fill up, I mean, really these would work in any vase. Honestly, I wasn't sure if they were going to work in that smaller vase, but I think they do well, um, but I just put the different five um, sprigs in there. You guys, if you have any questions for us, go ahead and leave those for us in the comments. We'd love to answer your questions. And if you're not already following us, make sure you hit that follow button. Delaney and I go live two to three times a week. All right, next up, you guys, is a throw blanket. Now, I really like these throw blankets because I have them in so many different colors, but if you find a good one, you kind of just stick with it. Now I would say my favorite one is this olive green one that I have here in my bedroom. It's a very comfortable um, throw blanket. 
it drapes really well. You can see where I have it there on that couch. It just looks so nice on that couch. It's got pretty fringe to it. They wash up really well. I have this in the olive green. I also have a um, blue one that's really pretty as well. But if you're needing a great throw blanket to put on the end of your bed, on your couch, this is the one you wanna go with. It's just so pretty. Um, and if you click on it, you're gonna see it comes in a bunch of different colors. All right, now this next item is a floor lamp that I picked up when I was finishing off a small basement nook area and I didn't have any side tables except for on one side. So on this side, I wanted a lamp, but I didn't have a table, so I needed to go with a floor lamp. Didn't want to spend a lot of money, so I was like, you know what, I'm going to give this one a shot. It was only $45. I thought, you know what, we'll see. I, I really wasn't expecting much from it. And I have to tell you, I was really surprised at the quality of this floor lamp. It is nice. It's black and gold, and you could see how well it looks in this grouping of items. It really just does a great job. And I know most floor lamps that you find can any be anywhere from like $100 to $150. So if you need an easy like floor lamp that's going to be really affordable, I would consider getting this one. I'm super happy with the way it turned out. Now on the other side of that grouping, you guys, I wanted to have some nesting tables that had glass on them. So I went with this set off of Amazon. I searched all of the high-end sites and then went to Amazon to try to find a dupe and I found this set. And this, I will tell you guys, on the higher end sites, these tables are really expensive, but I was able to find this set of two metal and glass top tables for $123. Now that really is a good price when I, you consider how much they are on other sites, but it's a set of two tables. They nest together, so you can see how the smaller one is in the other one. The cool thing about this is you can kind of change up the configuration. You can move them around. You could use them as a coffee table, a side table, pull it out if you need it, or you could actually push it all the way in. So I do like how you can kind of customize your table with um, the glass here. So love those hey deborah thanks for joining us here you guys if you're not following us go ahead and hit that follow button on amazon all right uh this next item is kind of more of a gadget that i kind of needed and learned the hard way so if you have a rug in your house that curls up or you just have a really hard time getting it to lay flat you may want to consider getting these never curls now what these are, are they, they are rubber bases that you stick onto the underside of your rug on each of the corners. And it's going to help to hold your rug in place. They're really neat. So if you have a rug that curls up, this is going to help with that. Um, I had a rug that I honestly considered getting rid of because it kept curling up and these really helped um, the problem. So the base of it is not sticky, it's rubber. So that's just going to sit down nicely on your rug. In my daughter's room, she had a rug that was actually in the center of her room that didn't have any furniture um, that was sitting on it. And because she had hardwood floors, that rug was moving around. So if you have any rugs that move around, these are great as well because it helps that rubber helps to stop the rug from moving. So if you have a rug that's moving, consider getting these and that will fix the problem. Yes, I love these little rug stoppers. They're really a great product. Okay, let's talk a few more florals. Now this next floral is one that I have in multiple colors. And if you click on the link, Delaney will tell us here in a second, but I think there's so many different colors to these florals. Yes, this is one of the items we're showing today that has so many different colors. Similar to that wall art we were showing you guys earlier, you can really get any color that fits your home and fits your style on these florals. These are some of my favorites for spring, you guys. Now. They do come in a bunch of different colors, but I love these pinks and you actually get several in the packs. Like I have these, but I also use them in another area in my house. But look how pretty those are. They're pink, but they're not, to me, the pink would go in so many different spaces. Like you can see this is in a room where I have some blues and, and you know, some really kind of traditional colors. That pink just gives it like that nice pop of color for spring. So if you're wanting um, any color for spring, I do like the pinks, but you can definitely change up the color to fit what works for your house. So love those. 
We had a question on YouTube from yeah. Eliza, or is it Elisa? Let me know. I know you've corrected me before on that. I have a very large wall behind my sofa. I can't find a picture large enough to put there. What do you suggest to put on the wall? Um, what I suggest is I in one more product, I have a great solution for you. Um, so let me go to this next product and then I will um, tell you my solution for a large wall. Okay, this next product is a uh, slip cover for your pillows. Now, these are some of my favorite slip covers from Amazon because I feel like they look the most high end of any one that I've gotten. I think what makes a pillow look high end is the fabric and the texture on the fabric. Now, these are pretty basic. They're kind of like a tan brown color, but the fabric on them, they just look a little bit more expensive, a little bit more high end. And you're going to get a pack of two in this set. And they're some of my favorites. So, and they do just come with the pillow cover. So you'll have to use your inserts. And what I do is I just use old pillows or ones that I want to recover and put those in there. And I believe those are 18 by 18, Delaney, on the pillows. I'll double check the sizing on that. It comes in a pack of two. Yes, these are 18 by 18, but they do have other sizes available. You do 16 by 16, 12 by 20, 20 by 20, and 24 by 24. They also have a few colors available. They're all pretty neutral. You can get some whites. There's some browns and beiges. There's also some shades of blue on there as well. So if you click that link, you're going to see all the different colors available and sizes available on these pillows, these pillow covers. Fawn, thanks so much for following us here on Amazon. Oliver and Sophia, thanks for watching as well. Okay, so this next idea is my solution for a large wall. What I like to do is to pick up a tapestry and Amazon has a ton of different options. So here I have a tapestry from Amazon that I bought and I just put four one by four boards. You know, I screwed them together to make a canvas and I just wrapped the tapestry around it and stapled it to the back. When you have a really large wall art, or sorry, if you have a really large wall and don't want to spend a lot of money on wall art, this is such a good solution. I mean, look at how big that wall art is. Look at how much space it covers on my wall. And this tapestry, you guys, is $12.99. So you buy the tapestry, some boards to put on the back, and you have a ready-to-go wall art. So that would be my solution if you're wanting super large wall art at the most affordable prices. Now, if you click on this tapestry, you're going to see that it comes in some other, um, I guess, um, artwork as well. So I just love blues and greens, so I tend to gravitate more to those colors. This one also comes in different sizes as well. So if you're looking for a longer tapestry, you can find those on the link if you are looking for those. I'm looking through the pictures and it looks like they have a lot of landscapes on these tapestries as well. So you could get some mountains. It looks like there's some water ones, mm -hmm. some snow ones as well. Yeah. All right. This next item is a hook that I use in my house all year round, but it is so affordable. Now, this is a set of, I believe, uh, 10, 12, 12 hooks. I use these all over. I use them in bathrooms. I use them in closets. I've used them in my RV. And if you guys have ever gone out and tried to buy hooks at big box stores, they are so expensive. This is a set of 12 for $12.88. And you can see these are not small hooks. I do like to put a piece of like a scrap board. I just cut like a one by four board and I'll put that behind the hook, but you don't have to do that. You can just screw them directly into your wall. But sometimes I feel like that board just makes it look a little bit more, you know, has a bigger presence and I'll just put a board behind it. But if you're needing some hooks in your home, pick these up. You're not going to find any that are more affordable. I usually have these on hand in case I have a project I need to do. Oh, so oh, I was, I was gonna just going to say, I know you got the pack of 12, but they also have a pack of six and a pack of 16. Oh, really? Okay. Okay. That's good to know if they need to get, you know, if you have different needs. Tammy and Aaron, thank you so much for following us here on Amazon. Appreciate it. And you guys, if you see anything you're interested in, go ahead and click on that link and go ahead and check out and um, yeah, and come back and watch us here. So, because we got a lot more to show you. 
All right, next up is a rug. Now, this is a very popular um, brand of rugs here on Amazon, but this is the one that I use in my bedroom. And gosh, it has been in there now a good two years, I think, uh, since the last time I redid this room. And I absolutely love this rug. I could replicate this rug or get a different pattern and put it in so many different areas of my house. It's a screen print rug, but it is held up really nicely. It looks great. It's just so pretty. So, um, and the one I have, I believe, I want to say it's a nine by 13. Does it show that Delaney on my purchase history? It's saying you got a six by nine, but I'm not sure. It might be wrong on that. I've bought several okay, versions. It might be a different version that I'm but, viewing right now. Cause I think you have yeah, a larger version. I think, I think I know the six by nine one I got, but for, this rug for my bedroom, I know it's a nine by thirteen. It's got to be at least a nine by thirteen. There's a nine by twelve. That must be the one that okay. this one is. It's Thank nine you. Nine by twelve. Yeah. So nine by twelve. That that makes sense. I think that'll work. And I have a king bed too for that room. But they're screen printed. They're just really nice rugs. So if you're if you're needing a rug, click on that link and just look around and see if there's a style that works for you. Yeah, like Liz was saying, she has several of these because you can get several different sizes as well as patterns on this rug that we have linked below. All right, so if you're somebody who likes the idea of having a garden but doesn't have a great green thumb, kind of like me, um, I found this herb garden packet off of Amazon that I'm gonna be trying. It's $15.99. What I like about this is all of the herbs are non-GMO and they come with 12 different herb types. So you get all of the different little herb packets and I'll show you how they're kind of set up. Um, that you get all these tiny little herb packets. You also get the soil pellet in here. So it comes with these, so they're ready to go. And you get an instruction manual that kind of tells you exactly how to do it. So if you're somebody who wants to have herbs, but is a little intimidated by it, like starting to grow it from seed, this would be a great starting point and the perfect time to get those going for spring. Hey, Tina from KC, glad you're here. Sarah, hey, thanks for joining us. All right, right, let's. I got so many items to share with you guys. So this next item is, oh gosh, so last year I was decorating an outdoor space and I was trying to find the most affordable items I can. One of the items I picked up, I had an outdoor bar. So I found this set of stools. You guys, you get four stools for $72.99. Like that's such a great deal. All of these stools stack on top of each other. They're a black metal, um, but these are great in the bar area. Um, so if you're needing any stools and you don't want to spend a lot of money, I definitely recommend this set. Hey, Kathleen, thanks for following us here on Amazon. Okay, let's talk a few of my favorite kitchen items. First up is this bamboo, I always forget the name of this, kind of a organizing box. Now this is what you would use for your foil, your parchment paper, anything like that that you're needing um, to put, I don't know, the, these bamboo dispensers have become very popular this year. So I will put these in my drawer. You can get the pack of two if you click on the link. They also come in a pack of three. So what you do is you just, um, once you pull it out of the package, you're going to open up the side area. The side area, you can stick your papers in the edge and they fit in really nicely. There's cutters on the top and they also come with these labels. So if you want to label, you know, that it's wax paper or parchment paper or plastic, you can do that. You can also hang this on the wall. I prefer to put mine in a drawer, but it's perfect personal preference and you just stick your paper in the side over here you pull it up through that window and then you can just cut them off you can also add labels if you want so let us know if you guys have this if you've tried this out before i prefer the one with three but i just think it looks so nice in your drawer everything looks nice and organized and honestly, I feel like it's easier to cut with these than some of those boxes. Like I'm always like wrestling with that box when I'm cutting off plastic wrap and this just makes it so much easier. So I do prefer these over any other, you know, way to organize what you have. All right, now 
Um, I want to show you guys our set of pans. Now, if you've never tried these pans, these are the pans I pretty much use exclusively. And they're the Green Life pans. This is a set of two that you can pick up. They're priced at $30 for the set of the two pans. There's a 10 inch one and a seven inch one. I have them here in the blue, but they come in a bunch of different colors. They're ceramic pans and you can, uh, it says hand wash them for a longer life, but you can put them in the dishwasher and they're great for low and medium heat. I've had mine now for over a year and they hold up really well. I honestly cook with them every morning for breakfast and we just use them throughout the day. So if you're needing a set of pans, may want to consider that. Now with the uh, spring and summer coming up, one of the things I love to eat is watermelon. And I have this super cool way that you can slice up your watermelon this summer. Now let us know in the chat if any of you guys have this, if you tried this machine, it's called the watermelon slicer. Now, honestly, when I picked this up, I thought it was just gonna be a gadget and it wasn't going to work at all. But I have to tell you, it works pretty good. Now I will say this watermelon I was cutting for the demo here was very, uh, it was very liquidy. But what you do is you slice your watermelon in half and then you just run the watermelon slicer through your watermelon. I mean, it cut really well and it creates these tiny little cubes. Like look how perfect those little cubes are. No way would I be able to do this. It also comes with a melon baller because when you're slicing through here, you're not gonna be able to get everything out. So at the end, you can use your melon baller to get you know additional watermelon out. But this is a great way to slice up your watermelon for the summer. Maybe you could, you know, there's nothing sharp on here, so you could give it to your kids. I know my kids would love to slice the watermelon like this. So that's another um, option for the summer. All right, now I recently redid my pantry and I have a couple of pantry organizers that I wanna show you guys. This first one is a set of jars that I picked up and I was really impressed with the price of these jars. You get a set of five kitchen jars for $27.99. They have these dark kind of wood colored um, lids. They're very airtight and I love how there's a bunch of different styles to it. And um, I just got two sets of these that I put into my pantry. You're gonna see how I've organized them here in my pantry. I also added labels to them. So they're really nice, they have labels, but look how nice those look. For $27.99, you can get five different jars. So those are linked below. Thanks, Linda. Now, another thing I put in that pantry is a set of Lazy Susans. Now, why I like this set is first you get four for $29.99. They're also a bit thicker, so you can actually put all of your condiments in there and they're gonna hold in a lot better than the shallow ones where things can just kind of topple over the top. These aren't gonna do that. And so I really like these for organizing kind of those corner areas of my pantry. And I like they're clear and you can see what's in there as well. Okay, another item that would be great home decor item and just looks so pretty you guys look at these. These are a set of candle holders and I have a clip. You'll probably be able to see them better in the clip, but you get three triangle um, candle holders that hold a tea light. Now they don't come with the tea lights. You'll have to put your own tea lights in there, but the tea light easily sits into um, these little wood pieces. They're very like rustic and natural looking. I just think they're so unique and different. They're honestly so different than anything else that I have. So one of my favorite items and one that I really use quite a bit and love. So I don't know, I feel like this is definitely something that, um, you know, one of those unique pieces that would look great sitting out on my coffee table or on a sideboard. I love this one. Like, look at how it's got, I mean, I'm assuming all of them probably look a little bit different. I know. I, we'll have to order more and see, but I think they all look different because these even look a little bit different than the ones in the link. Yeah. They're all kind of unique. You never know what you're going to get on these. I think these are really cool. This is also our first time showing these. This is a brand new item, brand new decor item. Yeah. We're Let me show them, Delaney, how to put it in. Like, I'll show them up okay. close here. So this is the top of it right here. So all you have to do is take your tea light and just stick it in the top here. You kind of have to press it down. Um, so if you have nails like me, you may need like a butter knife to pull it out when it's time to pull it out. 
But look how adorable those are. They're also like different heights too. You can see they're not all consistent, but super pretty. I also wanted to show, oh, wanted to show, or do you have something else? We had a question about yeah. where to get the Lazy Susans mm -hmm. on YouTube. If you want to tell everyone watching on YouTube how they can get over and watch on Amazon. Yeah, so there's an arrow over here. You want to click that arrow and then there's a link in the description box that says shop now it's shop a shop here. here shop here you're going to click on that it'll take you to where i'm streaming you can unmute me you can add any of the products that you're viewing to your cart now i want to just point out to you guys the top that i'm wearing because it is on major sale today now it's by the brand pretty gardens and it's priced at only 16 dollars 49 this is such a good shirt for the spring. Let me show it to you. Now, I have this shirt in a ton of colors. If you watch me on YouTube, you've probably seen it. It's a lace top, and then it's got like this waffle knit to the front of it. This one is in the hunter green. I have that one linked. And honestly, I feel like you could wear this any time of year. I mean, maybe some people wouldn't think it's spring appropriate, but I think it's cute for spring. Um, but this would be a great top that you could wear for spring. I also have it linked for you guys in the pink. So if you're interested in the pink, that's a great color as well. The other color I have it in is the white and it is absolutely gorgeous. If you do not like the white, I don't know. I, honestly, I love all the colors to it, but if you're looking for a pretty shirt for the spring, this is a great one. And because it has those lace sleeves, it's really great for the spring. I mean, it's one that I wear honestly all year round. So for me, it doesn't it doesn't have a season to it. I wanted to give a couple shout outs to everyone joining us on Amazon and everyone joining us on YouTube. We have Gwen from the UK says it's raining there as well. Ugh, I know we are all in on the rain today. And then Crystal's joining us again from Georgia. Hey, Crystal. Glad to see you here. I love it when you guys um, come and join us again. And I'm glad to see that you're here. Now, I do want to point out a few big deals for today. One is our essential oil machine. That is priced 26% off today. So if you are thinking about an essential oil machine, it may be the time to pick it up. This one is the one I use at my house. I just combine it with water, and then I'll put some essential oils in there. Love using it. Also, my essential oils I have linked for you guys, those are on sale as well. They're 20% off. My essential oils are $11.99. So maybe you're just needing to replace your essential oils. They are on a great deal today if you're needing any essential oils. Hey, Angel, thanks for joining us. Now, another thing that's 8% off today is our knot. This is our coffee table um, knot that we were telling you guys about earlier. This is perfect to put on a sideboard or you could put it you know, just sitting out on your coffee table. It's one of those great accent pieces. So love this and one that I use quite a bit in my decor. Okay, I wanted to show you guys all the things that we had on sale. Another was our black floor lamp. I was telling you guys how affordable the black floor lamp is. Today it's priced at $45, $45 which is 10% off. So a great deal if you're needing a floor lamp. I know the last time I tried to buy one at like a local store, it was $125. So if you're needing an affordable floor lamp, maybe give this one a go. It's great for any area where you don't have enough room to put a side table with a lamp. Like you can see here on the side of that couch, I just didn't have room for it. So I added in that lamp. We had a question from Kristen about the motion lights. Do you have to charge the motion light? Let me click on those, Kristen. So the motion lights, you do not have to charge. What you actually do, and we'll show you that video, you actually will um, put batteries in there. They come with trip or sorry, double A batteries. And then, and I will say my double A batteries have stayed, I've had them since November and they haven't run out. So I think it just really uses minimal battery. Um, but they basically take charge from the battery. So you do not have to charge them at all. I kind of don't like things you have to charge. I don't know. <laughs> um, Moni wanted to know what size shirt am I wearing? We'll click on the shirt at the end of the stream. Um, does it say, I think I bought a large, but Delaney, can you check for uh, us what let me size? Let check that real quick for you. 
It looks like you bought a large in this. Okay. And yeah. It goes from size small up to size extra large. Yeah. On so shirt. I would definitely size up. Um, you know, to if you're kind of in between sizes, maybe go with the larger one. Um, I don't know because I feel like I can wear a medium or a large, and I I don't think I would have wanted the medium in it. All right, you guys, thank you so much for joining us in today's live. All of the links are down below, so we'd love it if you clicked on them. Add them to, add them to your cards and check out. Um, if you're over on YouTube, make sure you come over and shop through our links. We get a small commission when you purchase through us, so we do appreciate you going through our links. And I hope you found some great spring finds today, and we will talk to you in our next live. Bye.